What's up guys, Skippy Africanus here, and in today's video, we're gonna be going over a neat little device that's been in quite a few Call of Duty games since Black Ops 1, if I remember correctly. The Semtex Grenade. This is one of those neat little gadgets that I always thought was, uh, well, pretty neat, you know, having a sticky grenade in real life. And, um, but I never bothered to actually look into these and, uh, you know, just to see what they are and if they exist, so... Doing this video, this is the first time I've ever researched them. Um, so anyways, we'll get right into it, and, um, the thing with Semtex, the way we'll break it down is, we're gonna go into what exactly it is, and its uses, and then also, of course, do they actually have Semtex sticky grenades? So let's go into exactly what Semtex is. Semtex is a type of plastic explosive, I think something like C4, um, and, well yeah, it's a plastic explosive pretty much. Um, there's some differences between it and C4. Semtex has a wider uh, temperature range that it can be, I guess, used at, and it's also colored different. Semtex comes in like kind of like a yellow, reddish color. C4 is like a weird gray. Um, Semtex uh, was developed in Czechoslovakia in the late 50s, and uh, if you're wondering where the high-tech name of Semtex comes from, they named it after a suburb down in Pardubis. Pardubis? I'm gonna say Pardubis. They named it after a suburb down in Pardubis, which was called. Semtin, and uh, the reason they chose that was because that's where the stuff was first manufactured in. So now, with Semtex, uh, it has two uses, mining and military applications, of course. Now, the thing with the military applications, um, well, we'll get into that in a second, but, you know, the first one is mining, and, yeah, you know, much like a lot of other explosives that can be used in, you know, military applications, the mining industry tends to use them a lot. Um, you know, to be honest, I thought I'd have more info with the mining one, but, I mean, honestly, it's it's kind of self-explanatory what they're using it for in mining. But, uh, let's go into the second application, the, uh, more interesting one, and that is military use. Now, as high-tech as Semtex sounds, really the only people using it are, uh, well, they're not first-world countries, I'll just say that. Um, initially, you know, countries like North Vietnam, Libya ordered an absolute ton of it. Countries of that nature, you know, you're not necessarily doing some high-tech, uh, I don't know, sabotage op- well, I guess you are doing sabotage operations, but it's not like, you know, hardcore First World Special Forces, it's, uh, guys going onto planes and, uh, deciding they don't like the airline food, so they, uh, ensure that plane lands a little early. But anyways, yeah, you know, Semtex, for the most part, is only really used by, like, you know, terrorist groups, uh, Third World countries that fund terrorist groups. Uh, Libya was the biggest buyer of it. They bought like 700 tons of it. Um, but that all leads to the question though, what about the sticky grenade that has been featured in all these Call of Duties, and especially this one where, uh, you know, this looks like some high-tech stuff. Well, uh, you know, I really, I really dug into this, and you know, I, I, while I've never really seen Semtex outside of Call of Duty, I kind of kept an open mind with it. I'm like, you know, sometimes there's some weird prototype stuff. I mean, Certainly, stick grenades have existed before. Think those uh, weird stick grenades the British had in World War II. Um, so I was thinking, well, maybe they had it and they just, it's kind of a weird item. They, they didn't use it that much. Well, they don't exist. Yeah, the, uh, you know, the, the famous, the famous sticky grenade uh, in all the Call of Duty games. Sadly, all it really is ever used for is like, well, you know, stagnant stuff. You, you're not, you're not throwing it with, uh, and having it stick to people. So, uh, anyways, I think that is gonna do it for this video. I'm not much of an explosives expert and, uh, you know, did the best with my research on the topic, and I just thought, uh, well, I just thought it was interesting because me, personally, I didn't know what Semtex was before I did this video, so. Yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this short little informative video on what Semtex is, and, uh, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. We're gonna be having plenty more of, uh, Guns of Modern Warfare 2 in real life videos coming out soon. So I'll see y'all later.